you. You move that piece of crap right now or I'll move it for you. Hey guys, what's up? It's Tyler here, and today I have a juice review for you. Um, and initially I had planned on doing this on my KTS Plus, but the spring in my fire button broke. So I just ordered a new one. This but this button's gonna be gold, so it'll be a nice little accent on this. Um, so once that gets here, I'll be back in business. Um, but since that's not working. I'm going to be using my MVP in my K fund because I have had that I've had this juice in my K fund for a week now and it's just wonderful. Um this review is not on this K fund. I already did one of those. Um this review is on Dr. Neptune's Astro Fuel, which is made by Olympia Vaporworks. And it's got a, a really cool bottle. It's all colorful. And I have this one in 6 milligrams. And it is 80 BG 20 PG, I believe, is what I had to make it in. Um, cool thing about Olympia Vaporworks, they have your their own little custom make your own juice thing. And, uh, well, when, when working out, getting juice to review, I didn't realize that, so I told him I wanted Dr. Neptune's Astro Fuel in 8020, and he took care of me and made it happen. So thank you very much, Olympia Paperworks. Um, overall, I really, really like this juice. It is a clear color, much like water. It is very, very thick, because it is almost 100% VG. Uh, which I have been vaping 100% BG juice for the past two weeks now. On top of everything else, usually I'll, I'll drip the 100% BG. I'll throw whatever else in my K phone. Um, and I have this juice in my K phone on a 1.6 ohm build. Um, I pretty much keep my K phone around 1.6 just so I can throw it on any device I want and have it work. So for instances like this where my KTS button decides to fuck up and break, I can throw my K fun on my MVP and I can still vape. Now with my Trident, that's a whole nother story. I have dual twisted 28 gauge coils in there at like 0.3, which will not fire on my MVP, so I cannot drip these juices. Um with this juice, I really like the fact that he took the time and made it 80. 80 VG 20 PG for me. Um, I do like higher VG juices. I don't really get that. I don't like that throw hit as much as I used to. Um, and it helps when you're cloud chasing, obviously, having a higher VG juice. Um, so this juice in the K Fun is wonderful. Um, if you watched my K Fun review, you know that the K Fun is more so built for flavor rather than vapor production and you have you can get quite a bit of vapor from a k-fun but they are more so built around giving you the best possible flavor out of your juice which is why if i get a juice and i'm dripping it i can't fully tell what the flavor is i'll throw it in my k-fun vapor for a few days and we are good to go um hold on one second Google. So I'm going to their website right now, see if I can find a description. Because even after with this juice being in my K fun, I couldn't really give a solid flavor profile on it because I feel like it has so many different textures, not textures, but different flavor notes in it. And uh, so I'm waiting for my slow internet connection to uh, load up this page. Alright, and I like it when websites have the little age thing before you even go to the website. That makes me happy. 
Although it's not hard to enter your actual, it's not hard to fake your birth date to get into this, but still. It's a nice little precaution. Alright, so it's lychee, mango, and kiwi, which I had the mango and the kiwi uh, down pat in this juice. They are actually very prevalent in this juice. I didn't get the lychee very, very much, um, but this juice overall has a fantastic flavor. And it is really good when you're dripping it. I just find it a little bit harder to get the full flavor from dripping. Uh, with this juice in particular um, But it is a great cloud chasing juice simply because it is a higher VG juice and um, Yeah, I'll go ahead and vape it show you guys the vapor production all that good stuff And it always, always tastes great. I like the K fun a lot because it has a very consistent hit and very consistent taste. The taste doesn't get changed or doesn't taste burnt if you build it right. And I really, really like that about the K fun, and that's why I try to put the juices that I can't really find the best flavor for in the K fun. Um, so like I said, this juice is Dr. Neptune's Astro Fuel, and it looks like it goes for. Uh, $14 for a 30 ml bottle. Let's see if I can find the 15 ml bottle price. If it's 14 for a 30 ml, I'm, I'm assuming it's 7 or like $6.99 for a 15 ml bottle of this. It doesn't have a 15 ml option. And they do have pretty much every option as far from 80, 80, or no, and from 10 VG to 90 PG, 20, 80, 30, 70, 40, 60, 50, 50, 60, 40, 70, 30, 80, 20, 90, 10. So I could have went up one more step, I just didn't even know that. Um, and you can get it in nick levels from 0, 12, 16, 18, 2, 24, 4, 6, and 8. So he has quite a bit of different nick levels for you to choose from with this juice, which I think is a great thing because I, I have a lot of friends that are like, well, I want like a 3 nick juice or I want a, you know, an 8, you know, somewhere between the 6 and the 12 or between the 0 and the 6. And I like that he has that option so you can do that. Um, overall I give this juice a 10 out of 10. Uh, the label is really, really, really simple, but it's really colorful. It kind of sticks out. The bottles are nice and a, like a sturdy plastic. They do have the locked childproof caps on them, which is always a plus in my book. Um, but yeah, it's Mother's Day, so I'm going to go out to lunch with my mom. And I will catch you guys later. Thank you for watching. Stay happy, vape bomb, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.